No matter the opponent, I never lose. <laughs> That's what you get! I can't believe you actually fell for that old gag! Fat lot of good all that power did at the moment of truth! Huh? Really? So that's what it is then? I have to say, even for you, that was a pretty dismal move! No! No! It can't be! If there were any brains in that head of yours, you'd have realized my speed has increased as well! Which means, unfortunately for you, that little ruse only succeeded in pissing me off! The Saiyans are a true warrior race! Don't underestimate us! If what I heard over the Scouter is to be believed, all seven Dragon Balls are needed in order to... I only need to find one to prevent Frieza from being able to use them. Once I get that wish, not only will I be granted eternal life, I'll be uncontested. Vegeta, you c isn't it obvious? I hate but to wrench why my right mind wouldn't I turn against him? Starting to get the picture, pretty boy? You're seeking to use the Dragon Balls for yourself. Frieza will not get his dirty hands on them! And once I'm given immortality, Frieza is as good as dead! This joke of an empire is finished! Certainly even someone as thick as you knows it'll take more than enough talk! You've never had a real taste of same power. So here, eat up! Progress intrigues me. Enough so that I feel it's only courtesy to show you the full extent of my own power. Something I've let lay dormant for many years. Such a sense of humor. You might as well know before you breathe your last breath. There's a very good reason I keep my full powers hidden. 
You see, exploiting them calls for a drastic transformation. Quite a distasteful one, in fact. Hideous, even. Naturally, I am somewhat reluctant to sacrifice my looks. But when my hand has been forced, what choice is there? <laughs> I'm waiting. Eager, aren't we? Very well. Don't say you weren't warm. <laughs> For all that pride your people had about becoming hulking monkeys, you are blissfully unaware of my transformation! Well, before I end your life, I'll tell you a little secret that's an even... Okie dokie, Vegeta. I hope you're ready, because now you're going to get... We are... The Ginyu Force! Raccoon! I'm far from done! Hi! Alrighty, the kid gloves are off now, buddy bull.
wise up. You're dealing with me now. Don't kid yourself. What makes you think you can take me now, Vegeta? Because with each battle, I'm getting closer and closer to becoming a Super Saiyan. Oh, come off it with your fairy tales. I really must hand it to you. In all my years, I've never been so angry as I am now. Now you'll pay. You vile, filth-sucking maggots will rue the day you cross my path! Go on, then. Do your worst. But if you think this is going to be easy, then you're dead wrong! You haven't a clue. <laughs> I've heard enough of your pathetic lies! Now get ready! You little wretch! Consider yourself lucky I didn't incinerate you! Uh, 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 he... The rest of you stay back! Just keep your... Someone's full of confidence, you poor fool. I doubt you'll be so smug once you realize what you're up against. What stands before you now is the thing you fear most. I am a Super Saiyan. There won't be a shred of you left when Kakarot wakes up. I think I'll toy with you a bit. Don't bother. So sorry to dash all your hopes and dreams, Vegeta. But for all your efforts, you never even came close to being on my level. You aren't gonna wanna hold anything back, Frieza. Not against this one. You see, he is what you fear more than anything else in the universe. You're dealing with the real Super Saiyan. Oh, Vegeta, you forget. I don't enjoy jokes, and you've never been very funny. You murderer! He couldn't even defend himself! Kakarot, I need you to know what happened to planet Vegeta, where we were born. It's gone, not because it collided with a giant meteor. It, it was Frieza who did it. 
We served him blindly for years. I'm, I'm begging you, please, beat him. For me, for the pride of our race, you must defeat him, please. No matter the opponent, I never lose! With my anger at its peak, it happened! Finally! I have become a Super Saiyan! Say you androids don't feel pain? You're very lucky. Do not bother, it is futile! Cursed robot!
Well, well. Not the sort of place I expected to find you three. But it'll have to do. Your leaving all of a sudden got me curious, I'll admit. Goku's house, wherever it is, to kill him. Just as I thought. But you... Hey guys, Vegeta seems to be pretty cocky, doesn't he? It must be a Saiyan thing. They always talk such a big talk, and then they end up dying so fast. It's a shame. You shut your mouth, you disrespectful toy! I'll rip all three of you to pieces! Let's play. Just you and me. Now, watch closely, Cell, because I'm about to wipe that disgusting smirk off that face of yours! I'm for 
were so close. A few more moments, and I would have achieved my perfect form. Now hold on. Do you actually believe this perfect form of yours can make the slightest bit of difference against me? Take this! I, I, I know it would. I would have the ultimate power. You wouldn't even stand a chance against me. All right, then. I'll allow myself to be goaded into your trap. Go on, obtain your so-called perfect form. Father, no! Stand aside, boy! Let me show you. Too slow! You're making a mistake, Father. We can't let Cell reach his perfect form. I've already seen one future ruined. I'm not gonna stand here and watch it happen again. I'm putting an end to this, even if that means I have to go through you. Is that so? <laughs> Who are you trying to fool? You're too soft-hearted to attack your own father. <laughs> He actually did it! <laughs> Cell really is transforming. Now we'll see if this perfect form of his is everything he made it out to be. <laughs> so this is what you wanted to achieve so desperately? Perfectly ordinary is more like it. Did swatting that little pest make you feel all big and strong? I hope so, because that was the last taste of victory you're ever going to enjoy. I suppose we'll see about that. But for now, I wonder if you would be so good as to assist me in warming up. Sure. Just know I'll be turning up the heat rather quickly. I'm terrified. <sighs> the way this is going, I have no other choice but to use my final flash. Cell! You have mocked me for the last time! Do you truly believe your power is far superior to mine? Here! If you have the guts to put it to the test, Let's see if you're strong enough to withstand this! Let's see if you can withstand this! I know! <laughs> well, that certainly left a mark, didn't it? Serves you right!
Okay. If you can punch me in the face, I promise I'll take you to that amusement park you're always going on about. Really? You mean it? Here I come! Now let's just see what you can do! He may be a super saiyan, but he's still a child. No way in hell I'm letting myself get hit. But... Babidi's using the evil in your heart to control you. Clear your mind. Remove all thoughts from your head. Sh shut your mouth! You... you know... nothing! Yes, yes! Now you belong to me! <laughs> now that you're under my control, I shall push your power past its limits! <laughs> Some place where there's no one else around. I'll give Vegeta the fight he wants, but not here. Let's go. It'll be over soon enough when I kill you. You know, it's pretty amazing. While well, I've been in other worlds. I've done nothing but train, and yet here we are now. You and I are evenly matched. What does it matter? Your inborn talents have still played. I wanted to go back to the cold-blooded saying I'd been in the beginning. The one who didn't care about anything but besting you in one-on-one -on -one combat. But surrendering to Babidi's magic was a price I was willing to pay if it meant I could be my old self again. That isn't true, and you know it, Vegeta. Vegeta, Prince of all Saiyans! You nuisance! 
Finally been revived. So, is that pink blob with the cape Margin Boo? Well then, you're going to pay for what you did to Kakarot's son! Pink blob? What's that? It just means you're big and ugly. That made Boo angry! So Boo make you dead! I'm not going to hell alone. I'm taking you along for the ride! Generating any wound, then defeating him in battle may be impossible. Trunks. Listen, take good care of your mother. What do you mean by that, Dad? Why are you telling me to take care of Mom? You know, from the time you were a little baby, I've never once hugged you, because I always wanted to make you a tougher man. Huh? Come here, son. Wait, Dad? What? Hey, cut it out! You're embarrassing me! Take care, Trunks. All right? <laughs> well, I finally figured out how to deal with you. Just in time. Goodbye to you all. 
Bulma. Trunks. And yes, even you, Kakarot. When we fought, you hid the true depths of your power, letting me believe we were equals. Now I saw it. Dad, then maybe this will convince you. Boo has absorbed every person we've ever cared about. Krillin and Chi Chi too. Even Bulma. Piccolo. My sons, Gohan and Goten. And your son, Trunks. They're all trapped in Majin Boo. Uh, Vegeta. Here it. Give it here. What are you waiting for? Hurry up already! Thank you, Vegeta. All right! I'm Vegeta and Kakarot together. Yes, that makes me Vegeta. And this. Get ready for this. Is Super Vegeta! What the hell is this? Just what are you? Take this. If you really want to dole out some damage, watch it. I know. Kamehameha! Just about enough fun for one day. So I'm going to give you ten seconds to say your prayers before I wrap this up. What do you say we get this thing started? Good. Who's up first? I'll fight you for it. Rock, paper, scissors! to hit him with everything I've got. Cause if we lose this one, then the whole universe is history. I want to see this Super Saiyan 3 of yours with my own eyes. <laughs> Our final battle has begun. With the fate of the entire universe riding on the outcome. Your strength is truly amazing, Kakarot. You've always been like this. Ever since the day I first met you, you were prepared to meet a challenge, even when it was bigger than you were. You never fight to kill, or even to win, only to test your limits and become the strongest you could possibly be. 
How can this Saiyan fight with such power? And at the same time be so gentle? Perhaps it's my anger that made me blind to the truth for so long. Hang in there, Kakarot. You are number one. Stay alive, Vegeta. Thanks, but I'm already dead. Impudent scum! The plan is underway. It's time for you to create a spirit ball. Wait, so your big plan is you want me to make a spirit bomb? But even if... No, the Earthlings will save themselves for once by contributing every ounce of spirit energy they have. Spring Kai, I need to make an announcement that every person on Earth will hear. Can you make that happen? Don't worry, I'll do it. It's kind of my question. Okay, guys, it's all set. And you can speak not to just Earth, but the whole universe if you want. That's more like it. Citizens of planet Earth, can you hear me? Please listen closely. As I speak, a great warrior is fighting Majin Buu on behalf of all Earthlings. But despite his bravery, the odds are against him! We need your help! 
Raise your hands in the air and offer your spirit energy to help us defeat Boo once and for all! Hey! Hardly anyone from outside our circle of friends is giving us their energy! This isn't good! Fat Majin Boo is about to die! Kakarot! I'll do what I can to buy you a little more time! Over here, Majin Boo! his evil peek behind the way already! Nice work, Mr. Satan! Go to hell! Ah, 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 ah. Damn it all! Goku, we used Purunga's third wish to heal you! You should be able to power up! Thank you, Dragon Balls! Later. Vegeta would be such a gifted speaker. Oh, that's my husband for you.